from the University of California at Davis. This is News Watch. It's fall harvest in California's wine country, and workers are busy cutting the heavy grape clusters off the vines. The ability to assess grape ripeness is essential for determining when to harvest. It's challenging to assess grape ripeness. Uh, takes a combination of experimental tools, scientific knowledge, and uh, sensory evaluation. Much of the difficulty is that there is often an implied standard of ripeness, when in fact, it is mostly subjective. 75-80% subjective. Uh, you can do some scientific evaluation, serves as a guideline, but the baseline is going to be sensory evaluation. Doomstra says ripening can vary from one plot to another. The window of opportunity to harvest is very tight. If you wait too long after that time, we get a cluster like this, raisined, sunburned. This is going to be useless for making wine. The differences in ripening across the vineyard are, uh, can be a problem, so you're not going to come out and pick your vineyard all at once. Um, differences between variety, differences between soil type, differences between irrigation, microclimates around certain areas of certain parts of the vineyard are going to affect your picking times. Another challenge in determining whether grapes are ready to harvest is that sugar content can change overnight. Reporting from UC Davis, I'm Paul Fotenauer. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.